Hey guys, Jed Johnson from Diesel Crew here. Thanks for checking out my video today. I want everybody to go over to dieselcrew.com. Right when you're done watching this video, there's a link to the specific post that I want you to look at in the description box right below the video. And the reason I want you to check this out is because I have a very special grip strength challenge for you this week. It's also Really, it's a two-part feature. It's also a combination um, Iron Master recognition, and it goes out to Slim, the Hammerman Farmer. Now, as you may know, if you've read my newsletter over the last couple of weeks, uh, Slim, the Hammerman, is getting inducted into the York Barbell Hall of Fame this weekend. That's in York, Pennsylvania. So, if you're on the East Coast, you know near driving distance of Pennsylvania, you should be there and check it out. There's lots of awesome stuff going on. There's a benefit for the Wounded Warriors going on all day long. And there's lots of other features. There's Grip Challenge, the, the Induction for Slim. There's uh, Feats of Strength by Dan Sinadoza. And, and many other things, not to mention the fact that you can go into the museum and check that out. I've been to the York Barbell Museum a couple of times and it's always awesome. Um, big props going out to Mike Condro for putting all this together at York. I'm sure other people are involved. It's just he's the only name that I know for sure. So um, awesome job to everybody that's doing it. To do my part, since I'm not volunteering, I just want to put out some, uh, you know, a little bit of information about Slim. I met Slim for the first time in uh, 2007. I'm going to try to put a picture up here in this video. If not, check out again the website and uh, you'll see I've got a, a few pictures if I can find them on my computer of Slim and he came up to the Global Grip Challenge in 2007 and he, he didn't compete or anything but he, he had a wonderful time he came and, and checked it out he was very impressed at what we were doing with the sport of grip and steel bending and he had made the trip after just recently prior to that having some surgery so he really couldn't do any of his performances but it was awesome spending time with him and uh, you know talking about the mighty Adam and, and things like that so Slim is a very special individual uh, a lot of people that I'm friends with have uh, trained with Slim learned from him uh, he's he's one of the last remaining old-time strongmen very very impressive feats of strength and when it comes to that, that's actually what we're going to do this week for this week's Diesel Grip Strength Challenge is a slim lever. Uh, I'm going to show you what a slim lever is, but essentially what you're going to need for this is a sledgehammer and a towel. The towel, you're going to put your hand right on the towel because you're going to be rocking the sledgehammer from the parallel position, flat on the floor, up to the vertical position. And you need something to pad your hand because you're going to be driving your hand into the floor and you don't want to wreck your knuckles by doing that. So you want to get something, this is, a, this is just a, like a wash towel. So, so get one of those, you're going to need one of those. And then you're also going to need a sledgehammer. So if you have a, you know, any sledgehammer will do. And then we'll figure out the scoring later. Maybe we'll do a vote for most stylish video or whatever the case may be. But, it, um, you know, get yourself a sledgehammer. I know I've done a, a few sledgehammer feats lately, but really, guys, sledgehammers are awesome for developing grip strength. And no matter what you need to use your grip for, whether you need to have a bigger bench press, um, better control on the deadlift, or if you're a strongman competitor, if you want to up your conditioning, if you want to get your hands right for grip contests, whatever the case may be, maybe you're just an athlete and you need to have strong hands for your sport like baseball players or football players. A sledgehammer is a great way to go about training and I've shown you several feats that you can do with the sledgehammer and you can modify them slightly so you can get repetitions and just develop the hand strength. So now I'm going to pause the video and set the angle slightly differently so that, I, um, so that I'm positioned in the shot a little bit better to show you this feet and then you'll be able to try it out for yourselves. Here we go. Okay guys, you got everything set up here how you need it. The hammer in the flat position on the floor. You're going to lift it up to vertical and you've got the towel here. You're going to roll it up and put your hand there on that towel. Now I'm in this position with the camera because there's actually a classic position, uh, a classic picture of Slim in this position 
performing his lever, and I, I tried to find one, tried to contact people about getting a, a picture, but everything that I find is watermarked on that picture, so I didn't want to go and take someone else's uh, copyrighted picture. So if you have that picture or any other pictures that you own the license to and you'd like to send them, I'll be glad to post them on Diesel Crew at the Iron Master recognition. So thanks for Tom Kelly sending that in. Tom Kelly is kind of a student of Slim and lives in the same town and he recognized Slim as an Iron Master a couple weeks ago when he heard it when um, when he heard that I'd be going to the York Barbell Museum. So um, so thanks a lot Tom. Now let's go ahead and perform this lift. Again what you're going to do is you're going to take the hammer from the parallel position parallel to the floor to perpendicular to the floor. So you take it from flat to vertical and what you're going to do is you're going to get in a position where you can drive into the end of the hammer and lever it up. Okay? So it looks something like this. Just drive down, bring it up to the vertical position, and lower it down under control. Okay? So that's what we're looking for for the challenge. You can use a six pound hammer, eight pound hammer, post them all. Just let us know what it is. The most important thing is you get, get it done, get it submitted, and we'll post the channel, uh, the videos for the challenge on Friday. We will decide a winner over the weekend. But uh, if you're in the area, if you're, if you're near York, Pennsylvania, make sure you drive down there because it's going to be a good time. Also, we're going to have a, a strength training. Um, we're going to get together and do some strength training um, in a, at a gym nearby. So if you're into grip and steel bending, you may want to check that out as well. But most importantly, come check out the induction for Slim Foreman. He's done, he's done an outstanding job as a strong man and been an example for many people. Uh, a lot of people are under his tutelage. They're his students. And uh, I've never heard a bad thing said about Slim. So um, any questions, leave a comment here below. If you're going to go to York, leave a comment below. Look forward to meeting everybody and enjoy the challenge. Look forward to seeing your submissions. Take care. Have a great week. Great weekend. See ya.